In this video, we're going to go over email templates. Templates are useful given that we can use them when setting up campaigns and workflows. The first thing I want to show you is the merge tags. Here is a list of the tags that we can use in our templates. You will be able to access them directly from the template builder, but if you want to see them all in the same place, this is it. Here we have the client type tag. It was created automatically right after we mapped the contact field when we sync the CRM content. Other useful tags are last name, first name, and email. If we keep scrolling down, we can find the header and footer tags. The two most important ones are unsubscribe and subscribe preferences that you will be using in most of your templates. Okay, let's click on library and on email templates. I already created a simple template here, so let's open it. Like I said, it is a very simple template, just plain text. If you are just starting to send emails with your domain, I recommend using plain text when possible. Don't include images, buttons, and any other HTML that could make your email end up in the spam folder. If that happens, your domain score will decrease. With plain text, you have better chances to end up in the contacts inbox. To customize the template, we can use merge tags. So let's add one. Click here, and then on merge tags. This is the contact name, so contact merge tag. And select first name. Now we're going to add the word there, here, and here. This word will replace the contact name if the contact doesn't have a name. The email will say, hi there. Now we're going to add an unsubscribe tag. So let's select the word unsubscribe and click on the insert link button. Now click on personalize and then on header and footer merge tags. We are going to select unsubscribe link and click on OK. Zoho Campaigns requires you to add an unsubscribe link. So if you don't add it to the template, the system will automatically add a footer to the email where the unsubscribe link will be. We're going to review this in more detail when we send a campaign. Let's save this template. Another option when creating a template is using the basic templates. There are a few options here, but we're going to choose blank template. Click on save template, add a name, and save. This is the template builder. Let's add a layout. On the left panel, we can customize it. For example, we can increase the top padding and click on done. On the elements tab, we can see that there are many elements we can use in our templates. The one I recommend adding is the footer one. This way you can customize your footer, making sure the unsubscribe link is in the template. All right, let's save this. If you want to create a plain text email, you can use the HTML editor. So let's name it and save it. Here you will write the email contact as I showed you before. Now, if you want to use your own HTML, click on this icon to insert it. You can use a third-party tool like I show you in the Zoho CRM templates video to create your own templates.